So here's the deal. <laughs> okay. So I'll just I'll 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 do this the one that I'm most excited about last. Okay. Oh. So in the we're gonna just do do you want me to do east and west? Let's go. Okay, do so west, west first. Give me, give me playoff. I, I want to continue my good mood as West long as first, possible. okay? Yeah. So in the West, the Vancouver Canucks would play the Nashville Predators. Uh that's I got uh, a Nashville question for you, Adam, in the press conference. Uh Winnipeg <laughs> Jets would play the Los Angeles Kings. I'm sure they would like oh, that matchup. The Dub Wobble. I need that like I need By the way, team. LA Kings fans are ready to fire that guy into the sun. I saw at, during the game and I after he was the game. Better. Was, no, people are so no, pissed. Dubois's been Especially at the end of the game, game. apparently it's just no hustle. No hustle. Um, Dude, he's paid like a star. You got to play like The Dallas Stars would play the Colorado Avalanche. That's... Ooh! <laughs> Life is That's paid. unfortunate. For yeah, both it's a of shame. Them. Yeah. It's a shame. Um, oh, uh, that's it, the series of the first round. Because you lose a so monster. You yeah. lose monster. This is why I hate this format, because you lose monster teams in the first round. I want yeah. the monsters in the later rounds. Is that rounds, the 2-3? That's the two three. Two three That's sucks. Stupid. Two three fucking yeah. sucks. No. It's terrible. Yeah. It's brutal. um and uh Vegas and Edmonton. Rematch. Oh shit! Oh nice. We got that. Nice. Yeah. Dude, oh, no, that was a rematch. Wait, no, what am I wait. Yeah, it is. Yeah. I thought it was Winnipeg. No, Vegas beat Edmonton last playoff. Second round, right? Yeah, second round. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So wait, Vancouver, Nashville. Yeah. Which is really, really funny because Vancouver should win that in a landslide, but UC Soros. The Dubois Bowl with Winnipeg, LA mm -hmm. is great drama. Colorado, Dallas is spectacular hockey. No one could beat that. Boom. Vegas Oilers. <laughs> yeah, just don't sleep. Baby. Hell yeah. And then you got, so here's what's crazy is that it's. Don't even tell me the East. I don't give a shit. Uh, That's amazing. What has got to be decided between Ed Edmonton and Vegas at this point is, is by points percentage, Edmonton would have home ice advantage by actual points currently because Vegas has played three more games. Vegas would have the advantage. Got it. Okay. So, uh, okay. In the, uh, in the East. Mm -hmm. So we've got Florida, Tampa. Oh, Florida. Wow. That's the Good one I was shit. most excited about. Good yeah. shit. Listen, Tampa's not had and, and please stay out of my DMs on this one. You haven't had a good year by Tampa standards. End of story. They know that. No, they don't. Every time we mention they it, don't? it's a problem. Uh, well, some people don't. Well, they have the Hart Trophy winner. Yeah. That's right. Kucherov, right. Yeah. No, I'm saying like they, they have lots of things to be happy about this year in terms of like mm -hmm. individual performances. What? When I uh, went at Kucherov for being an enormous diaper shitting baby at the All Star game, boy, they were not impressed. That's what I'm telling you. But because he was trolling, you see, he was trolling. Oh, yeah, okay. It was an intentional, brilliant thing he did on purpose, and not simply the act of a hungover man being miserable. Yeah, I think yes. that's what it was. Yes. Now, do they have a name for the tour when Tampa plays Florida? Like, it's the, it's the battle the of something. Because it can't be Florida the dominate. Because Florida, the, they call them the Florida Panthers, right? So you can't yeah. really call it the Battle of Florida. That doesn't make sense. Mm. Do we the, have a do the we have DeSantis a Bowl? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no. Okay, not that one. Can we come up with something the beach catchy? Party. Something that go on a T-shirt. The tiki, the tiki bar party. Uh, <laughs> Battle of the horrendous shirts. They're not both South Beach, so you can't do that. No, you can't. No, I don't know. No, we'll come up with something. Yeah, we got to We got to be better than this. Um, yes, we do. <laughs> the New York Rangers would play the Detroit Red Wings, who are winners of six straight, by the way. Detroit Red Wings appear to be for real. Watch out. Patrick Kane, too, come al has come alive the yeah. last little bit. The got team, tons of points. The team he wanted to go to last year that didn't bring him back mm -hmm. versus. Uh, oh, there's yeah. some rumors about uh, I saw some rumors about Tarasenko going to the Rangers, but they couldn't fit him under the cap. No, so and they can't they retain can't him, him back. again. Yeah. They, they're they not. They're not allowed on the CBA to retain on him. So I don't think it works. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Uh, they should have just resigned. But anyway, that's a good series. Uh, a good hockey series. Yeah, that'll mm -hmm. be a, it'll be. But there isn't like the rivalry there yet again. Like it's a it's an original. So, six, yeah, like, there yeah, will be six by the um, end of the series. Though will, there will be uh, this one's I, I think this one's my favorite one just for the lulls. Carolina, Philadelphia. Oh, Ooh, the Tony D'Angelo. <laughs> Love that. Philly, one. That's actually great. Philly yes. is so much better than anybody's willing to give them credit. Why for. are they selling? <laughs> yeah, man, they're better wow. than Philly's willing to give them. Credit yeah, for. it's true. Daniel, <laughs> Daniel Breyer sitting there like, fuck, we're good. No, Damn, I, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I actually think he's smart. If, if I were if I were him, like if the Leafs were truly. Vicious. 
in the years they should have been vicious, mm-hmm. the team would have been a lot better, a lot quicker for a lot longer. Mm-hmm. They should have traded guys like JVR. They should have traded guys like Bozak on expiring deals, own rental. What a crock of shit. Let's do right by the player. What a crock of shit. But- so if Briere has the balls to go and trade a Sean Walker or any of the other guys that are apparently available, um, I and they make the playoffs, I respect the hell out of it. It's actually yeah. kind of brilliant. Like it, it, selling while in a playoff spot in the Metro kind of makes sense on account of the Metro we, is but we called it the Metropolitan and people were pissed at us and we were right. Absolutely mid. Um brutal. And then the Toronto Maple Leafs Boston Bruins. Nice. Listen, life is pain. If if life Toronto if Toronto pain. wants to and here's here's what I'm hearing, okay? We got a new CEO of Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment. Mm-hmm. Oh, good. And this guy has a broadcast background. Met him several times. Steve, I think you've met him. Jesse, I think you've met him. Keith Pelly. Keith was, Pelly. Yes. He was our boss's boss for years boss, at Rogers. Boss's boss's boss. I sent him emails that he didn't read for a year. That's yes. okay. No. Yeah, and that's okay. <laughs> yeah. You, you probably, probably don't hold the grudge about it. No, no, I'm busy, not. man. No one read them. Don't worry. <laughs> this is a guy who is credited along with Scott Moore of creating what is now the cult that is CFL on TSN. They, those guys put it together in the 90s, basically saved the CFL, to be honest, on it. Seriously. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, the, the European golf tour is thriving. The European golf tour is thriving. They can wear shorts, thanks to Keith Pelly. Mm-hmm. Uh, bring uh, us back to Boston. No, what I'm saying is that... That Boston series will be the most consequential series of the last half century. Why? Because if they don't win, Shanny's gone. You oh, think? Yeah. Shanny's gone. If the Leafs do not win, you will see the end of Brandon Shanahan in Toronto. Mark my words. I hope that's you it. You are right because all the evidence points to uh, they they keep him around and he's good and they like him as a boss, but. The evidence that you have is that there's somebody new in charge above him, which is, I think, a very good thing for the organization in that you get a new fresh set of eyes and that the 11 years of failure on the ice, uh, there actually be some consequences. I, I think way, guys, here's right. what I also think. No, no. Oh, please. Well, I got this crazy outside the box thing that I want to try. What if we keep it the same? I hope they win. <laughs> So this is oh, the, yes, and obviously. this is why this is obviously, why Stephen. When, no, it's not obvious. So this, no, but here's here's what's interesting about that though. I think Shanahan's no fool, and I think he knows it. Oh yeah. And this is why and we talked about this in the Calgary segment: the invisible hand of Brendan Shanahan, the invisible hand of uh, 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 Murray Edwards. The Leafs are going to be extraordinarily aggressive at the trade deadline. If you think that they're not looking at this stuff, every team is. Every team is looking at who are our potential matchups. Florida and Boston? Ugh. 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 Okay. Well, I guess we're going to have to do something. The Toronto Maple Leafs are going to make some big moves. Yeah. It's going to happen in the next few weeks. And if they don't well, get through Boston. One week. Well, yeah, next week. You don't yeah, have. Are, there are not a few weeks nope. left. They're going to claim somebody off waivers, Jesse. Sam there's, Carrick. There's about on. 10 days. Um, is he on waivers? No, he's not. Oh. No, he's, he's, he's a trade chip. Um, yeah. Really? Apparently, he's he's valuable piece now. Okay. Um, Good for Sam. Yeah. Good happy for Sam. I'm just going to tell you that that it this is this next three months. You thought June last year for the Toronto Maple Leafs with Dubas leaving and that weird press conference. May. Yeah. Or May. Sorry. Yeah. If you thought that was interesting. <laughs> June. Yeah. No. Adam was just uh, like a week off. <sighs> there Get you go. Stuffed. There you go. If you thought that was interesting, you watch. This Toronto Maple Leafs team, this era, the Shanna Plan era, either... Something ha- something good happens, which we all want. Yeah. Or it's over. Or they'll be Shanna, That's it. Shanna banned. 